is, I'm not sure I, I recognize the May, but we'll see in just a moment. Well, good luck. Solstice is really good. They got like, they got top eight at Evo yeah. for this game as well. And, and they've been winning. They got, they won ECT, I remember. They just recently knocked me out of the Rev Tuesday bracket uh, this last week, or this week. They knocked me out of Combo Breaker. Man, we got to do something about this, but <laughs> let's see what we got going on. Steam Gorilla. Uh, that big JH. Yeah, this matchup I feel like is going to be played a lot in the air. Mm -hmm. um, looks like Solstice has got Steam Girl knocked down here, spends the burst. Yeah, we're going to see, I feel like we're seeing a little bit of grounded here, but both these characters love to jump. Like, May loves her JS yeah. and JH, and Ram obviously loves JH. So. <laughs> And that's something that hasn't changed with May in any generation of the game. Oh, she yeah. Loves to be in the air and she will nuke you for hitting you. And those those buttons are pretty pretty insane. Like JS and JH counter hit both mm. will just like you will lose sixty to seventy percent. But Solstice is getting some good pressure here. Let's jump out from Steam Gorilla. And you know, a lot of people don't really understand like what makes Ramathal like oh. a struggle character. And one of the things is that whenever she's comboing you, she you build a lot of meter just from getting yeah. hit by Ram. Like, all of this, you can see I mean, uh, killing the meter, but it's building up the burst. Yeah. Like, Steam Girl is definitely get the, gonna get their burst back. If not at the end of this round here, yeah, that's mm -hmm. gonna kill. But yeah, immediately got burst back. You can basically burst Ram, like, once around and know that you're probably gonna get it back for the next one. Mm -hmm. You have to use those opportunities, and Solstice is obviously an expert with Ram, and they will not give you that many opportunities to burst. Nice a lot of their turn. pressure is safe. Yeah, Steam Gorilla is pushing Solstice in the corner, spends the burst pretty aggressively. I, I like that burst. Yeah, because you'll definitely, especially if you start getting hit by Ramex, he's going to get that back. Yeah. Like, bursting early in the round, I think, is more beneficial. Oh, gets caught by the Daruo, though. The corner oh. carry. Yep, it's the wall stick. 50%, so you're going to get mixed. Here we go. Oh. gets hit. Yep, it's going to be carried back into... Oh, unfortunately, <laughs> drops the wall spot here, but... It's another hit from the sword. It yeah, Solstice is building so much meter, too. Yeah, this is Guts Crush. Oh, no! Oh, oh, oh no, no! Oh, no. <laughs> okay, that could have been worse. <laughs> it could have been worse. At least landed with some right, with some invul, but yeah. Wow, a strong chunk from Solstice taking the first game. I saw Steam Gorilla trying to fuzzy jump a lot of the pressure there, but Solstice is just covering you yeah. and forcing you to just stay in that spot. That's, like, that's your corner now. Solstice is definitely very good at covering the options. Mm -hmm. Wow, pushes in. Into the corner burst, that yep. yeah. Can't burst there. Yeah, bursting Ram 4P is, is yeah, it's really hard. <laughs> but 4P over you really just want to get out of the corner. Like, obviously you want to get out of the corner, but when you're getting hit by Ram, it's just, just tap, 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 tap. You're just like, oh, let me yeah. out. You see that, you see you're back to the corner and you're just like about to eat Ram mix and you're like, please don't eat. Like, I, I, don't, I don't want this. Yeah, sometimes you just have to accept that. You know, the mix yeah. is going to happen and it's not going to hurt that much. So you might, might as well try to block it. Or at least start bursting, you know, yeah. when you get hit by something big. Steam Gorilla, unfortunately, getting caught out here, like you were saying, getting caught with some of the jump outs. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Caught out of the J2H. Okay, a little bit of OTG. And Solstice just running it. Yeah, on, on set point here. Yeah, the mix. They'll at least get burst back before the round ends. Yeah, it so might we're going to get a mix here. here. Nice Ooh. block on the low, but unfortunately gets wall stuck. Yeah. Oh. That could have been worse. Oh, big J2H. Oh, oh that was up. missed opportunity. Again, you're going to try it again, but this time Solstice was ready. And yep. the Guts crashed again. Into the explode, yeah. And a strong, strong ender from Solstice. Yeah, one of the coolest things about Exert is obviously like the Guts system. Yeah. But people who are really good at crushing your Guts at the end of the round, it, it, it always looks really, really cool. Because you just get lots of little hits and yeah. people are probably wondering why you're not doing a big hit there. But it's just like tap, 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 tap to deal with the paration the, the guts. guts crush combos are just like they look almost you know, you know the jam like the two <laughs> yeah. five people it looks like basketball combos yeah. from, from like uh, h and k yeah it's, it's, it's so, so sick it's so sick and it's also something i feel like really differentiates a lot of like good players from bad players because like you yeah. the good players will get those guts, guts crush combos and they, they know them really well and they're able to yeah. end rounds which you don't want anybody to like live with like a sliver of health especially in a game like exert where you know, Ram can just start set playing you. Yeah. You gotta like deal with that, or you know, Slayer can just one shot you. It's it's really hard sometimes to recognize. Like you don't want to, because 